All right, so happy crazy. Finally, we got some new stuff. Happy crazy Tuesday release. We got a great game, Yoku's Island Express. I was, I was really, really, I don't know. First and foremost, I like the cover, the artwork, and everything. But that's not what got me. I got to downsize. I'm purchasing everything. I'm sorry. I have to cut down. I got to go back to my old, old, old self and buy games that I really want to play. But the ones before it was pretty much, but some of them, yeah, they were surprised to me. But Yoku's Island, from the guys that brought us this, how possible can this game be bad? Because honestly, it really made me think about this when I saw the gameplay. And still, Sega, we still didn't have, and we still don't have, a sequel for Sonic Spinball. What are you waiting for? So, Yoku's Island Express is pretty much a Sonic Spinball. It's an adventure of this bug that is pretty much, it's, it's kind of epic. I don't know how to describe it. it. You're playing throughout a pinball level, adventure pinball. Plus, Team 17 made this. Now the other surprise I want to point out is, how come limited run games, if you want the Swiss version, well, it's only on limitedrun.com, but you, got, you guys, Team 17, still, this was a main title. Available everywhere, just say it. But, like I was saying, the adventure in a pinball world. A new type of platformer, new type? A new type? Mm, yeah, I would say, because that was pretty much just the pinball, honestly. But still, boss battles and everything. But this one, yeah, I would use a unique blend of pinball mechanics, platforming, and open world exploration to unlock the secrets of Mokumana Island. That's pretty much what I've been trying to say in the last two minutes. Exploration, pinball mechanics, very original gameplay. Now, that's the type of game I want to play. Something original, something new, something fresh. I doubt I'm going to hate this. I'm, I got a good feeling I'm going to fall madly in love with this. Got it for the Switch. It was available pretty much on everything. But had to grow the Switch collection. So let's see if we got anything special inside. Anything special. Team 17 might give us something but if you look sideways it's pretty much empty it's pretty much empty yeah having a hard time trying to open it all right we got a back artwork cover with a limited warranty text what a bummer team 17 no goodies so that's pretty much the game cartridge so that was the quick unboxing we got another one on this crazy release tuesday i haven't gotten everything there was another game on nintendo switch coming out today but i gotta stop and slack it was lost child or something it looked very boring i didn't want to get it from nice america i didn't like it so stay put we got another special unboxing don't forget to thumbs up the video support this channel please